We'll go ahead and call the meeting to order then. We'll start with our pledge. And Commissioner Davis, if you'll do our prayer. Oh, right here. <laughs> Turn in. I pledge allegiance to the, to the flag, flag of the United States, States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, God indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Dear Lord, thank you for this time that we have to come together as a commission. We ask, dear Lord, that you watch over us, give us the wisdom to run our community in the proper way. We ask that you make our decisions right for our people of our city. We ask that you make it for the furtherment of your kingdom here on earth. God lead and direct us, for we pray it in Jesus' name. Amen. Welcome everybody out tonight. Big crowd. <sighs> Quality. This Quality might be the smallest we've ever had. <laughs> well, Mike's not, here. Mike's uh -huh. not even here. Uh -huh. He came by and he said, what's on the agenda? I said, nothing. He said, well, I think I'm going home. I said, well, well, I was going to say, this is a sign that things are working pretty smoothly and things are going pretty well because there's nothing on the agenda <laughs> to speak of, to talk about. But we do have a couple items, and the first one would be approval of minutes. I make a motion we approve the minutes. Second. We have a motion and second. Any further discussion? Those in favor signify with aye. Uh -huh. Aye. Opposed, same. Motion passes. And the next is the bills. Move to pay all bills. Second. We have a motion and a second. Any further discussion? Those in favor signify with aye. Aye. Opposed, same. Motion passes. And we have one item under old business. That is the city clerk position. We did advertise. Had uh, how many applications? Eight or nine. And we did interview uh, several applicants, and I think... Larry's got one who would like to recommend. Yes, I'd ask the city to hire Georgia Brown. Uh, she's had she's gotten 10 years experience in the baking system with PBI and Limestone. She is currently working at uh, Circuit Clark, Clark, Clark. Shannon Kirby's office. And uh, she uh, she showed interest. We talked to her, had a very very nice interview. And I'd ask that we hire her. Started out at fourteen dollars an hour. After ninety days, going to fourteen fifty. I make a motion that we hire George Brown. Second. We have a motion and a second. Any further discussion? When will she start? Uh, August the second. She's already got her vacation planned yeah. and paid for her end of August, so our uh, end of July so will be August second. And okay. she wanted to give notice at at the, her current position. Uh, did I guess the notice is still going to go? Because we told her if. You know, some places you give notice, they'll let you. They'll just go ahead. Let you go. Yeah, they, they yeah, get through. Yeah. See, so we'd work with her if that's the case. So. Do yeah. I need to put in here her, the rate of pay? Yes. Okay, tell me that again. Uh, starting at fourteen, after ninety-day probationary period, or fourteen fifty. Sandy, do you know her? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, my number two. She's a good girl. Okay. Those in favor, signify that. Aye. Aye. Opposed, same. Motion passes. David, do you? Have James? That's nice, no, no. Sandy? I uh, don't believe it is. Charles? Uh, one thing, uh, officers in the fire department, we have an opening, and due to a special circumstance, if you want to know that, see me later. But we like to your approval to place Jeff Jones in as lieutenant of the fire department. His bill fill the un, uh, unexpired term that would be through January 1 of 2022. Whose term is he? Second. We have a motion and a second. Any further discussion? Those in favor? <laughs> Those in favor, signify with aye. 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 Opposed, same. Motion passes. We need to think of something else for him. <laughs> <laughs> Kevin, you got anything? Well, we got, we got one thing. Uh, the AARP grant failed. I'd like to make a motion to go ahead and start work on the and try and get it finished as quickly as we can on the pickleball course, but we need to advertise to take bids, I guess. I, well, it should be under 30000 Yeah, we wouldn't really have to advertise. If, we, if it's under 30000 I'm going to get a hold of the man up in Louisville and let him come back down again, and uh, we'll get that we'll get that started, get that rolling again. I think it would be fine. a motion? Uh, is that, that, that I think a motion, we need to I guess. do a motion to I'll approve. Second. To approve it, because we're going to go ahead with it one way or the other. And I'll second that then. We have a motion and a second. Any further discussion? I understand from talking to some of them that's been down in the area, it gets, they've got one kind of makeshift down there now and gets quite a bit of use. Yeah, David's seen it. I've been down there a couple We're times. I've been home. Football practice. Sure. Sure. practice and no shirt. Using it more than I thought it would be used. There's usually a crowd down there. I was surprised. I was doing my. And what exactly was your motion, Kevin? To go ahead and start with the work on the pickleball course as soon as possible. 
I should say courts, not court. It's courts. Caveman is. That's it. Except for this, do I need to read about this? Uh, well, you can tell them about it, but I think uh, you need to get with them first. And yeah, I'm going to get with these hospitals of Ohio County wants to put in a garden down at the park for people that can come in. It's a hospice memorial garden is what it's going to be called. So I assume it's going to be involving people in, that have either participated in hospice or are in hospice or something. But it's going to be sponsored by the hospital. Well, it's actually going to be sponsored by Hospice of Ohio County through the hospital. And uh, we're going to start that. So we may be getting with you on some suggestions on that. But they, they apparently have got everything all lined out. All we have to do is approve it. But I'm going to talk to her first and make sure everything's above board. Is it like a flower garden? Yes. Mm, a memorial garden is what memorial, I took the memorial garden is what it's called. The Hospice Memorial Garden is what it's called. There'll be some minimal work by city employees to get some groundwork probably. Yeah, right? Actually, they're supposed to take care of it. All we need, all they needed from us was to get the water to it and the electric to it, and that's it. They want a fountain and they want water, and that's it. That's really all they wanted. Do they, they want to pay for it putting in, or were they? No, they're taking it? care of all the all of it. That's that's, that's the way I read it too. Yeah. They did ask. The only thing they asked for the city was to well to pay the electric bill. <laughs> yeah, which would be minimal. And the labor to put the, the stuff in. No, well, they, they didn't they even say that. that. I would have no problem working with them. The way I read it, it looked like they were going to do it. Uh, well, that's we had volunteers to assist and upkeep. Yeah, that can be worked out, though, if, yeah. they, if we need to run a water line. or Yeah, So, uh, but I'll talk to them tomorrow. But that's, that, I just want to be aware of that thing. That's it for me. Okay. The only thing I've gotten, it really doesn't take any kind of form of motion or anything, but I know we've been working on the downtown and beautification and stuff, and uh, our new street signs and stop signs should be delivered. Oh, they got Friday, delivered already. Friday, Friday. Okay. Exciting. We're putting them on West Third Street, East East Second at my in Main. West Second and Main will have a street sign, obviously no stop sign. Then we'll do stop sign at Madison and Second and Lafayette and Second. So I quit having to pick the bucket up. Huh? So I quit picking the bucket up. <laughs> you said Lafayette and no, this, the new one's going to be in a bucket, too. Lafayette, second. <laughs> Lafayette second, Broad, and Second. Now, I said Lafayette, Broad, and Madison. I'm sorry, Larry. We didn't, I didn't, we didn't do one at the top of the hill, Lafayette. But to the kind of signs, it's the company we buy a lot of the stuff from, and I've talked to them. They're pretty much standard, so we can kind of add to them if we want to move up to Lafayette. We want to do some more on 3rd and out on 62, but they're the... You said West 3rd and 1? East Second, Broad and Madison, and then West Second and Main. You've got the list. I'm running down again. <laughs> I'm putting on here. Larry has the list. I don't know if this even needs to go on here or not, but it's on there. Has it been? Needed? Yeah, Larry has lists <laughs> in the minutes. <laughs> but that was just another step, and and uh, the only other thing, just so you all will be aware, I don't know any details yet as far as dollar amounts, but I know everybody's been hearing about the uh, CARES funding, and there's some other initials. There's about three different pots of funding for COVID relief coming to the cities. Uh, I thought they were going to try to have it where we'd have some in June in the last fiscal year and then the other half this fiscal year, but it hadn't happened yet. So they're still trying to get all their interim rules, but I'm, I'm kind of going through now and highlighting what all it can be used for and can't be used for. So we will have some projects uh, to come out of that, but it could be a substantial sum of money. Didn't they do so when it's possibly coming? Well, like I said, I thought they were going to do it in the last fiscal year and part of this fiscal year, but they didn't make it, so. Well, let us know that we talk about a wish list. <laughs> But like I say, just so we can get to kind of an idea of what can be used. So, all right. Yeah, I got a couple things here. Uh, <coughs> one of the boys that we hired a couple months ago, uh, David Hayes, he actually has his CDL license. The only thing that he needs to make them active is a uh, physical. Uh, we've got a physical schedule for him today, and I would ask after completion of his physical that he would receive a 50 cent raise, but I think it's what we'd talk about with the other employees. Do you need a form of motion? Yes. We'll go ahead and make that motion that we raise it. If he gets a CDL, that we raise it 50 cents. Second. We have a motion and a second. Any further discussion? Those in favor, say anything about that? Opposed, same. Our street mowing tractor is down. 
Uh, we found another one. We can't get parts for the one we have, so we, we have found another one. Uh, it is a 6320L with a side mount mower. Uh, we're, we're wanting to trade our other one in and pay the difference. Uh, I'd ask the city that we go ahead and move forward with that. I think the trade trade and the difference is 162 with with the with delivery. How much newer machine is it? Six years. Six years newer. A 97 to a 2003, I think what it is. How many hours do we usually put on one in a year? Or how long do you use it? I guess I'm not trying to. Well, if we. If I mean, it doesn't get used a whole lot. It only runs three days, and we run it usually for, uh, once a month. Uh, with that being said, the more we have, the more we can use it. So. Right, but it's it's not like we not extreme. We'd have to have a brand new. Right. It's not going to get exactly. hours, lots and lots right. and lots of hours on it. Yeah. Well, I make motion to buy that particular what machine with trade-in. Amount was uh, sixteen two was the difference with the trade-in, and it's a sixty three twenty L. I'll say it. We have a motion and a second. Is there any further discussion? Those in favor signify with aye. Aye. Uh, same. Uh, update on the new well that we're still waiting to put in the service. Uh, so the state has received the plans. They're in the engineering side, so we're still waiting to hear from them. And we have started on making road doors on Stanley Lane uh, up across from Cemetery, replacing an old water line that is out in the middle of the street that we actually don't own. And uh, we had repairs on it before, so. We've, we've got most of the road boards done, hopefully have it completed within the next couple of weeks. Up, up around David Anthem's house, just kind of an update. Is that why there's water, line, water lines in my yard? I'll wait till we get down with your yard. <laughs> That's okay. <laughs> well, I got a big boom truck coming in, big backhoe coming in, I'll just tear that water line out in the back of the field. Won't bother me at all. You got it on record? <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. I don't, it's not, you know, well, he's been on it. Uh, <laughs> how long has it been in the ground? It don't matter. Don't have anything. <laughs> I think it does after a while. I haven't been in hey, that long. You just talked to our attorney when we're done here. <laughs> What's the status on the drilling up on Main Street? We're waiting, kind of waiting to get some of this CARES money. CARES money. So we can turn okay. it away. I figured it might be some incidentals that we need to wait on. Well, part of this funding, the first things that came out on it when they started talking about it, three of the big things you could do with well, one, you could do anything that replace money you lost due to COVID, which ours will be minimal. But you could do uh, water sewer infrastructure and broadband. Well, even if we got two or three million dollars, which we're not, but if we've got two or three million dollars, that's nothing to broadband. I mean, no, that's no, not no. even a ripple in the, so I'm not sure why that was listed, but the water and sewer got plenty of that. obviously is. And that was a project where we're gonna do anyway, and we've gotten the budget to do, but if we can use this, New hydrant up on Coaching. Was that a replacement or a new one? That had an accident, wasn't it? We had an accident there. How did I miss that? Huh? Oh, that, that was a huge accident. accident. Yeah. Lady running the stop sign there on Broad and Tra Trailer hit her. Same off on Goshen. Mm -hmm. Anytime without a town, I don't remember that. It was a car. There was a tractor trailer involved too, wasn't there? Mm -hmm. Was it he just was sitting there? He was a witness. I just saw him sitting there. I thought he was involved. I've in been it. out of town all day on that because I don't remember that. It was a Friday afternoon. Went to my house. It was a bad accident. It was, it was right at before five because my daughter in law called me. She said, If you're coming home, you might want to come a different way because she said, Water's sky high. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Was it an older woman who pulled out in front of somebody or just she just pulled out? She was trying to stop sign. That's Why not good. She's trying to stop sign there. She's Lord have mercy. That's the worst place in the world you can run a stop sign. Really? That's what I thought. She was coming this way and tried to cross Goshen. Bang. She must not have been from around here. She's from here. Although that's not no, no excuse for that. <laughs> Any no foreign substances involved? Mm -hmm. Are you sure? No, <laughs> I'll I'll sorry. <laughs> that's all I have. Okay. Ivy, you have anything for us? Two things. Uh, the, fir the first one, the water contract, is a, is a work in progress. I'll run it by Larry first. Um, and the second thing, the lift station. Um, uh, I've had several conversations on that. Um, uh, Bigger staff is doing a survey of, of the ground, 30 by 30, and also had a follow-up conversation with, I, I, talked, I talked to Ms. King, and then I had a follow-up conversation with Chuck Hagen, uh, and uh, what they're proposing is 
to do an easement, uh, deed the 30, 30 by 30, but do an easement giving the city access. But his inquiry was, do we want it to come off of the highway and go up to it? I think so, yes. Okay. It's my understanding the bigger staff's also going to do uh, a, a description of the easement as well. And I'll, I'll get those to you as soon as I got them, but, but I, think, I think Mr. Crooms is doing the... Uh, I think they surveyed it off Thursday or Friday last week. Do what now? I think they surveyed it off Thursday or Friday last week. Have they sent you a plan or anything? No, I just seen them up there and there's, I think the corner markers are located. Okay. Like, no. All right. All right. Well, I don't know. I don't know if Chuck had told him yet that he also needs uh, to uh, do a description on the easement, and I'm not sure because apparently he does most of most of the family's uh, uh, property work. I'm not sure whether he's going to do the deed or he's going to want us to. It's not going to matter as long as he have the description. But I, I'm hoping that that'll be done. Uh, Fairly soon. Okay. Anybody else have anything? Well, again, I think this brief meeting shows just how well things are running right now. Question. Sir. You said the AARP loan. Was that for the pickleball courts? Okay, so no, you're just going to... We're just going to build them anyway. Okay. I, I just want to make sure. We use part development money. Yeah. We... we yeah. We were going to do it one way or the other. We were just hoping we'd get the grant, which yeah. would have alleviated a lot of mo alleviated a lot of money, but didn't get it. So we'll go on anyway. So. Entertain a motion to adjourn. Second. <laughs> huh? No. I'm sorry. I asked you if you had anything. <laughs>